other way would you want to spend your Monday morning? But some of the big boys are back, Kate, for Paris Saint-Germain after some extended rest from yeah. the World Cup. What changes to the lineup for them? We'll get to them shortly. PSG makes six changes following a 5-1 defeat against Arsenal on Saturday. And coming into the side, we see the likes of Kevin Trapp, Marco Verratti, Angel Di Maria, Gio Lo Celso, Kurosawa, and Kevin Riemann at the back. Plenty of talent in there. You have the ball. All the best to you. Opportunity for the youngsters like Colleen Dagba, who has played on the left-hand side as well. Opened their campaign against Bayern. But Atleti, two changes for them. One in goal, Adan comes in for Jan Oblak. And the change wide left, Mikel Caro comes in for the youngster Carlos Munoz. Not a bad front two, Kate. Not at all. Gamera and Vieto. I'm looking forward to seeing Carrero trying to find service into them. Vieto Gamera will be the targets inside the box. It's been a while since these two last met. The Emirates Cup, North London. Back in 2009, a one all draw. Julie equalizing for PSG. Some kid named Aguero scoring for Atletico Madrid. Wonder whatever happened to him. We've had lots of goals in the games so far. If this one ends all square, we would head to kicks from the mark as they're known in the official FIFA laws penalty kicks the second game of pre-season for Atleti after the one-all draw with Arsenal they play Stuttgart, Cagliari and Inter pre-season under their belt against Atleti who've only had one game so far I think PSG would be a little bit more conservative they were in the sticks see what PSG have got lined up here net for goal sneak it in at the near post Angel Di Maria during the summer, Rodrigo in from Villarreal, Thomas Lamar from Monaco. Kevin Gamero has been here for a while, and he's got the opportunity. What a save that is by Kevin Trapp. He was out quickly, the goalkeeper there. Look at the bounce of Gamero. First wins that first challenge, able to body off the defender in Carrero, trying to get to it. Waiting to see where the ball is going to pop out. Trap, excellent power steps to his left. Fancy this one, Lucelso. And there's Nkunku. You've got a touch on that one. Party. This is when they are very dangerous. Kevin Gamero has plenty pace. Can he finish? Atleti loves to sit in that low block and known for their explosive counterattacks. A wonderful through ball in between the defenders. Was some Gamero not able to cut out the defender, not taking it a bit more central. Wants to use his right foot all day long. Trap is giving him a little bit more. Coming up, Barca and Real Madrid. Obviously, it's the three of them again. Verratti. Rabio. Still the two lines of four for Atleti. This time from Angel Di Maria. Di Maria. Rabio wants and gets. Lo Celso. Well, it counts as a shot on target. Green Riemann. Colleen Dagba. Better. Now in it goes in Konko. Well, Atleti paused. PSG hoped for a penalty, and Kunku got on with it. 1-0. Down the flank. Nkunku not able to get to it on the first time. It comes. out of trouble. Not this time, though. What a chance this is for Atleti. Didn't look up enough, and then a heavy touch from Rodri got away with it. How is that not the equaliser? Timothy Weir, highlights from the first half in this one. There's that block on the line by Kevin Ruman. It's interesting that he already took position there the entire time. Did you notice that? Yep. So early, he just left his defender. He saw Trap come on out, and so then he decided, okay, I'm just going to go sit on that line. In that time for Rodri. Oh, that's a good hit and a really good save. 
Caught that one well, Tony Moyer. Very comfortable in that position. Not able to chest it down, but all over the park, trying to figure out exactly how to stop these high-caliber players. The head of Postolacci looking for Tim Weir. What's the chase, and he beats oh. his man and puts it just wide. You wait an eternity there for the goalkeeper. Look at this, the bouncing ball back. It's looping in the air. Terrible ball to play your goalkeeper. Adan didn't know what to do. Why didn't he come out earlier? Why isn't he starting higher? He still had six yards till the top of his box where he could have actually grabbed it with his hand. Good through ball. Come from the save for Kevin Trapp. Just come back to the incident. This run starts from Gamero at the midway point. He takes off, even though he's at the midfield line. Opportunity in the first half where he tried to chip it with his right. Keeping it on the ground. Might be the next way to go. Try to befuddle Trapp. Oh, good save again. And uh, this time denying Tim Weah. Stretch line wasn't going to go at pace. It starts on the left. Look at Weah on the back shoulder of Moya. Just a first time. I love that he took... On front, providing the overlap. Oh, what a chance. Still there. Should have been from Vieto. Well, Trap just giving him, it's okay, buddy. Try next time. Juan front again, providing all the service that has made Atleti dangerous. Just too much from Vieto. It bounces through. He's trying to get something. Zagri. Diaby. Great run. Zagre. 16-year-old denied. Forward players on show. Atleti are about to make a whole host of changes as well. And this ball continues. Zagre was the one that started it, able to get a shot off his dragby. What's the strike? So close. First ball, not so great, but look at all the organization underneath that picked that up. Yejo and Garces are now the front two for Atleti. Having to do some defending here. And that was rather easy how SG able space again for Zagri. I like the look of this young kid. What a delivery that is as well. And Postolacci finding over. Well there. But then the mistake. It's Musa Diaby, and it is two. Atleti in possession, the quick turnover, and the second goal should put this one to bed. Two now. Well, all the substitutes making a big difference in the second half, with PSG dominant on that left-hand side in the attack. Poor ball back by the defender and Diab. Keeper came for that one and was in no man's land. At the second attempt, Victor Moyejo gets Atleti back in this one. First shot of his was blocked and the 17-year-old kisses the badge. Atleti have the deficit, 2-1. Every single offer. Here he is. A little deflection on the own goal off Antoine Bernard. It's 2 2. Sometimes it's better being lucky than good. Full of smiles on the bench for Atleti. to China for the French Super Cup against Monaco. Can they get a winner here? Yes, they can! Virgilio Postolacci with a stunner. And look what it means to the PSG players.